Ever thought of inhabiting another planet? Well, scientists predict that our descending generations might have a chance. They have discovered that around a rounded red dwarf star, Proxima Centauri, which is also closest to the Sun, orbits an exoplanet Proxima b in its habitable zone. The distance from the planet to the star is about 7.5 million kilometers and its orbital period is 11.2 Earth days. Proxima Centauri b is estimated to be 1.3 times larger than the Earth. It has a rocky surface and since it lies in the habitable zone of Proxima Centauri, there is also a potential for liquid water and comfortable surface temperatures of around 30 degrees Celsius. It might also possess an atmosphere where we could breathe. Moreover, it receives about 65% of the amount of radiative flux from its host star compared to what the Earth receives from the Sun, making it even more suitable to inhabit. But wait, don't start booking tickets to Proxima right away, for there are some obstacles that you must know. The habitability of Proxima Centauri b has not been established as yet. The planet is subject to a stream of particles from the atmosphere of stars at pressures of more than 2000 times those experienced by the Earth from the Sun's atmosphere. In addition to that, Proxima Centauri b receives about 400 times more X-ray radiation than the Earth does. This radiation and the stream of particles are likely to blow any atmosphere away, leaving the undersurface as the only potentially habitable location on the planet. NASA states, just because Proxima b's orbit is in the habitable zone, which is the distance from its host star where liquid water could pool on a planet's surface, it doesn't mean that it's habitable. It doesn't take into account, for example, whether water actually exists on the planet or whether an atmosphere could survive at their orbit. Atmospheres are also essential for life as we know it. Having the right atmosphere allows for climate regulation, the maintenance of a water-friendly surface pressure, shielding from hazardous space weather, and the housing of life's chemical building blocks. Apart from that, its accessibility is also questioned. Though it is the closest habitable exoplanet, its distance from Earth is approximately 4.2 light years, 40 trillion kilometers away, which means that if you travel by the speed of light, it will take you 4.2 years to reach there. Nothing we've built so far can reach that kind of speed. In fact, traveling in a modern space shuttle would take 165,000 years to travel to Proxima b. The fastest outward bound unmanned spacecraft yet sent, Voyager 1, has covered about 0.2% of a light year in 30 years and is currently moving at 18,000th fraction of the speed of light. At this rate, a journey to Proxima Centauri would take around 80,000 years. Breakthrough Starshot is a research and engineering project by the Breakthrough Initiatives to develop a proof-of-concept fleet of light sail spacecraft named Starship to be capable of making the journey to Centauri B star system at up to 20% of the speed of light, arriving at Proxima in roughly 20 years, with notification reaching Earth a little over four years later. Now that's real speed, but we'll still have to wait for three decades for complete details. Anyways, that is it for the day. We'll see you in yet another video. Till then, take care and stay at home. Stay home, stay safe.